Praise the Lord. Uh, we welcome all the kids, those who are gathered here and those who are watching in online. Now is the time to praise and worship our Lord Jesus. So please stand up in God's presence and let's close our eyes, bow down your head, join your hands with a word of prayer. Open your mouth and praise God. Let us invite the presence of Holy Spirit in our midst. Hallelujah. Let us ask the Holy Spirit to take control of the each and every session what we are going to do today. Let us ask the help of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. He is our Redeemer. He is the bread of our life. He is the Lord. He is the Creator. He is the Alpha, Omega, the beginning and the end of our lives. Hallelujah. The Lord, El Shaddai, Adonai, He is a beloved son. Let us ask His presence to take control in our lives. So all the kids, those who are gathered here, raise your hands to the mighty heavens. Let's open our mouth and praise God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We worship your wonderful name, O oh Jesus. Amen, amen, hallelujah. You are the hope of our glory. You are the morning star. You are our everlasting Father. We praise your wonderful name. Hallelujah. You are the abiding Son. You are the anointing King. We worship you, Lord. Hallelujah. Comforter, we worship your wonderful name. Hallelujah. You are a high priest. We worship you. You are the author and finisher of our lives. You are the rock of our salvation. Hallelujah. Prince of Peace. We worship your wonderful name. Hallelujah. Comforter, Spirit of God. Amen. You are the spirit of wisdom and understanding. Lord, please come to us. Anoint each one of us with your holy presence, O Father. We submit our lives into your mighty hands as a humble sacrifice. Take control of our lives, O Father. Hallelujah. As we read in Psalm 7, 17, I will praise the Lord according to his righteousness, and I will sing praise to the name of the Lord Most High. The song goes like this. Lord, I come to you. Let my heart be changed, renewed, flowing from the grace that I found in you. Lord, I come to know the weaknesses I see in me will be stripped away by the power of your love. Let us invite the Holy Spirit in our midst. Hallelujah. Let us humble ourselves before the Lord and sing his beautiful name. Amen. Hallelujah. Lord, I come to you, let my heart be changed, renewed, flowing from the grace that I found in you. Lord, I come to know the weaknesses I see.
Hallelujah. Let us ask the control of the Holy Spirit to lead the service. Let us submit our body into the hands as a humble sacrifice to the presence of God. Lord, please bless each one of the, those, those who are standing right now in front of me. Lord, bless all the children, all many children yet to come. Make them to come at the proper time, O oh Father. Each one of them, today they are going to tell the memory verses. They are going to participate in the eloquation competition. Give them your spirit, your wisdom, so that they can do, they can prepare the task well, O oh Father. I, I submit each one of us into your hands, O oh Father. Give your guidance. Let the spirit take control in their lives, O oh Father. Hallelujah. Glorious Father, O Lord Jesus Christ, please give us a spiritual wisdom and insight. And let your heart, let your heart filled with light fill our lives, O Father. Help us to understand the incredible greatness of your Holy Spirit's power for us who believe you. The same power that raised Jesus from the dead. Give us the spirit flow. In the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus, we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can I hear a louder hallelujah? Amen. Please sit down in God's presence. Uh, so the Lord has brought us today and you are so excited. Yes or no? You are so excited to recite the memory verse what you have studied. And uh, all the adult children, I hope you are so excited uh, to tell what you have studied. So the past uh, nine weeks, we studied on nine topics. Uh, our theme is on, we are the race of God's glory. In that theme, we studied uh, many subtopics. And today and next week will be the revision week. And so today we are not going to study. So today you are going to uh, tell what uh, it's like the exam. Okay, so what did you study from the English Sunday school? This is a time for testing you testing your skills and testing your memory how uh, well you have been through okay so uh, today we are having many exciting uh, things to happen and i'm so excited to watch all things yes or no are you all happy in god's presence hallelujah many are not having this valuable opportunity but jesus has given us and i am waiting in god's presence let other kids those who are given the names because i have uh, many people's name in my hand i hope all the kids come in the correct time okay so let's all pray for that and let's all pray for the holy spirit uh, let them be led by the holy spirit and uh, the spirit give them the understanding and the good memory power so that they can recite the memory verses correctly now uh, sister jeba and team will lead us in the praise and worship so let's all clap our hands and welcome them Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Can you all say it louder? You all had lunch, right? Yes or no? Chicken, mutton, biryani. Everybody had, no? Yes. With a full energetic voice. Can you say it louder? Hallelujah. Good evening. How are you all? Fine? Okay. We are going to sing the song and praise God. How many of you remember, my God is so big? so strong and so mighty it's an easy song right can you increase the uh, beat benny will you increase the beat okay can you all stand up so all the chicken mutton you have eaten have to work now okay you have to clap your hands and sing it louder okay yes Can you all clap your hands? My God is so big, 
So strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God. My God is so big, my God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. One more time. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing. The mountains are His, the rivers are His, the stars are His and He works too. The mountains are His, the rivers are His, the stars are His and He works too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. So you all are doing the action, but you are not singing. So this time you are going to sing it louder. You are not going to do the action, only you are going to sing. I'll start the song, you are going to sing. Okay? Okay with boys? Yes? Okay. I'll start and stop, okay? You have to sing it. Okay. Yeah, can you all clap your hands? Ready? One, two, three, go. God is so big. Louder. Yes, very good. The mountains are His. The mountains are His. The mountain. Mountains are His. The rivers are His. The stars are His and He works too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. Turn to your neighbor and say, nothing my God cannot do. Turn to your neighbor and say, tell to your neighbor, Nothing my God cannot do. He's all powerful God. Yes? Okay. One more song we are going to sing and praise God. Every move I make, I make in you. You make me move, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Can you all clap your hands? Every move I make, I make in you. You make me more Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. One more time, every move. Every move I make, I make in you. You make me more Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Louder. Waves of mercy, waves of grace. Everywhere I look, I see your face. Your love has captured me. Oh my God, this love, how can it be? Na, 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 na. Na 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 Every move I make, I make in you. You make me more Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. One more time. 
Every move I make, I make a new. You make me more Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Waves of mercy, waves of mercy, waves of grace. Everywhere I look, I see your face. Your love has captured me. Oh my God, this love, how can it be? Na 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 Every move, every move I make, I make in you. You make me move, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Can you all sing it louder? Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every move I make, I make in you. You make me move, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I take in you. Waves of mercy, waves of peace. Everywhere I look, I see your face. Your love has captured me. Oh my God, this love, how can it be? Na, 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 na. Na 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 he is the truth. Can you all say it louder? Jesus is the way and the life and the truth. Can you all shout, shout hallelujah? Little more louder. Hallelujah. Please be seated. Hallelujah. Can I hear a louder hallelujah? Yes. Raise your hands and tell a louder hallelujah. 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 Amen. Okay. So, as I told you earlier, today we are not going to study. Today is a revision part of our English Sunday School. And uh, we are believing many of our kids, they are given the names. They are yet to come. So, we are waiting for that. Uh, so, now is the fun activity session for that. It is based on the memory verse illustration. Okay. So I will tell the name list given to me who and all participating in the memory verse uh, illustration. Okay. Uh, King Jassil, Sharon, Benihin, Kiruba, uh, Daniel, David, Blessen, uh, Rusenka, Queen, Reuben, Raja, Jaden, Sam, John, and Jonah, Gracia. These are the names given for the memory verse participation. Is anyone your name not uh, blessing? Are you prepared? Yes? OK. Now, uh, you all come, friend. Uh, go and get your uh, things, what you have to get. It is with, uh, see, the participants has to tell the theme and bless the memory verse. OK. So, um, Please get all the crafts provided. I will tell the theme in uh, what theme they are reciting the memory verse. So the first theme is on uh, light of restoration, Psalm 119, 105 uh, by King Jassil. The second is light of reconciliation, Psalm 145, 8 
by Sharon and uh, Light of Justice by Benihin, Light of Good Works by Kiruva and Light of Springs of Everlasting Water by Daniel, Light of Humility, David, Light of Empowerment of the Holy Spirit, Blessing, and Light of Overcoming Temptation, Queen, and uh, Light of Peace, Reuben Raja. Okay, so where are the participants? Come, come friend and stand with your crafts and uh, each one has to recite according to the order given. Okay, so is there a stand mic available for the small kids? Okay, please all come and stand first. Stand in the order. Please, Sharon, come inside. All come inside. Uh, once again, let's all clap hands for this wonderful kids. All clap hands. They will be recited according to the theme provided. Okay. Now, first, we'll have King Jaziel reciting the memory verse on Psalm 119-105, Light of Restoration. Let's all clap hands and encourage him. Uh, Sister Divya, can you uh, give the memory verse thing to Sister Jabba so that it will be easy for her to check whether the kids are reciting properly. Okay. Now the first person, King Jassil, with light of restoration theme. Light of restoration, your word is a lamp for my feet. Participants don't a speak. light on my path. Psalm 119-105. Okay, Psalm 119-105. Next we have Sharon with light of reconciliation. Light of reconciliation. The Lord is gracious and compassionate, slow to anger and rich in love. Psalm 145 verse 8. Very good. Let's all clap hands for Sharon. Okay. The third participant is Benny Hinn with Light of Justice. Light of Justice. Do all things without complaining and disputing that you may become blameless and harmless. Children of God, without fault in the midst of a crooked and of a crooked and and preserve generation among whom you shine as lights in the world. Philippians 2, 14 and 15. Very good. Let's all clap hands for Benny Hinn. Next, Light of Springs of Everlasting Water by Daniel. He is reciting the verse from John 12, 35. Then Jesus said to them, Light of springs of everlasting water. Then Jesus said to them, A little while longer the light is with you. Walk while you have the light, lest darkness overtake you. He who walks in darkness does not know where he is going. John chapter 12, verse 35. Very good. Let's all clap hands and encourage the small kid. Next comes David with light of humility. Esaya chapter 42 verse 16 Light of humility I, I will uh, I will bring the blind in a way they did not know I will lead them in paths they have not known I will make darkness light before them and look at places straight these things I will do for them and not forsake them. Isaiah chapter 42 verse 16. Very good. Let's all clap hands for him. Next, Blessing. Blessing with light of empowerment of Holy Spirit, John 3.20. Light of the empowerment of the Holy Spirit. For everyone practicing evil gets the light, does, the light and does not come to the to the light, lest his need should be expert. John 3.20. Let's all clap hands. Uh, let us encourage them. Okay. Now we have Sam with light of overcoming temptation. You will heaping pepper fish. 
Use mind stare on you. Yes, sir. Because she paper fees. Yes, sir. Twenty six three. Very good. Next, John, light of peace. You you will keep him in further peace. Whose mind in stayed on you because feet like you. Yes, I are twenty four three. Let's all clap hands for John. Next comes Jaden with Light Team. of Restoration, Psalm 119-105. Theme, Light of Restoration. Your word is a lamp for my feet, a light on my path. Psalm chapter 119-105. Okay, let's all clap hands for Jaden. And then Johin comes with the theme, Light of Reconciliation. He is going to recite uh, the verse from the Bible, Psalm 105.8. Let's all clap hands. Please come. Light of Reconciliation. The Lord is gracious and compassionate, uh, slow to anger and slow to anger and rich in love psalm 140 psalm 145 verse 8 thank you very good okay and we have reuben raja and queen come friend and recite the memory verse what you have studied queen on light of everlasting temptation and reuben raja on light of peace the body of the temple you will keep him in perfect peace whose mind stays on you in you because he trusts in you. I, Isaiah chapter 26 verse 3. Very good, very good. Let's all clap hands for them. Okay. Next is Queen reciting the verse. James 4, 7. Submit to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you. James chapter 4, verse 7. Very good. So, these are the children. They did their good job. They recited well. So, we are going to give prizes for all the kids because all recited well. So, let's once more clap our hands and encourage the kids. And... Uh, I encourage the parents who took effort uh, to uh, make the children to recite the words, verses from the Bible properly. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. You can go and sit in your places. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay. What? You are all shocked because the next is your turn. Yes? So, be happy. Okay. Enjoy the presence of God and what you have studied, you just tell. That is enough. Okay. Um, can I hear a louder hallelujah? Hallelujah? Yes, louder hallelujah. Yes. Boys, can I hear a louder hallelujah? Okay. Now a fun activity session has been finished. Now we are moving on to the uh, teaching part. Okay. So The teaching part um, every please kids don't don't talk and don't disturb so please listen now is the teaching part okay now uh, today since uh, this is a special uh, week of today we have our teen service girls and boys to teach us on the theme what they study okay so they are going to uh, tell many points what they studied on the light of restoration 
light of reconciliation, light of justice, light of good works, and the light of springs of everlasting water, uh, light of humility, light of empowerment of the Holy Spirit, light of overcoming temptation, and light of peace. Okay. So I will tell the participants of the elocution competition. The first participant is Joshiba, second is Alsina, Ajay, Sam, Ashmita, Rufus, Aaron, King Joel, John, and uh, Celsia. Is there anyone left? In boys, Aaron, are you prepared? You prepared, John. Okay. So come in order. Okay. I repeat the, uh, the participants of the eloquition, please remain silence. Please remain silence. Okay. Please don't talk in between. It's disturbing. Okay. Please don't talk. So the eloquition competition, uh, I asked Sister Sheila Joan uh, to see how they are reciting and how they are telling according to how they are presenting. You should put the marks. Okay. Now first, uh, the participants has to tell the theme. You have to tell the theme. And uh, Sister Divya, can you come here? Can you please give this uh, notes to Sister Sheila so that she will check whether they are telling correctly. And Kavin and Johin is also prepared for the elocution competition. OK. Now, uh, first we'll have Joshiba. Let's all clap hands for Joshiba. OK. Now I'm going to talk about David. We have already learned about uh, this in the theme, Light of Restoration. So shall we recall it? OK. In so, 2 Samuel 7, 8, uh, ch chapter 7, verses 8 and 9, we learn that God gave a promise to David that uh, he will always be with be with him wherever he goes and uh, the places where david went in second samuel 8 uh, chapter 8 verses 6 to 16 we learn that david uh, that we learn that first david um, for, uh, he went before saul with an offering and um, he and later on, he, uh, he went to the Philistines and rebuked uh, Goliath. Then he returned to Saul one more time, and um, David got honor and uh, earned an enmity. In 1 uh, Samuel uh, 22, uh, verses 1 and 2, we learn that David depart, uh, departed and escaped to the cave of uh, Adullam, where uh, Many of his fathers and brothers were uh, heard about it, and uh, some of and few of the people have joined David. Uh, the people were in depth uh, distress and uh, discontent. About 400 people were uh, with him. And in uh, 1 Samuel 23, 4, uh, chap uh, verse 4 and 5. David inquired once again, and God said, Arise and go to uh, Keilah, which belongs to Judah. I will deliver Philistines into your hands. In 1 Samuel 23, verse 14 and 15, David was in the wilderness in Zeb. Uh, Saul sought him every day, but God protected him from Saul. What kind of a man was David? He was the son of Jesse in Bethlehemite. He was a man of valor, a man of war. According to the Bible, uh, David was the man of God's own heart. It's given in Acts 13, chap uh, chapter 13, verses 22, a man of my own heart. In Psalms 50, uh, 51, verse 10, it says, Create me a pure heart, O God. Renew a steadfast spirit within me. David was a shepherd, and um, <coughs> King Saul wanted to uh, hated uh, David, and he wanted to kill David. But even after knowing that David uh, wanted to be loyal to him, and um, 
the Philistines assembled and set up at uh, Shunem. Uh, Saul set up a camp at uh, Gilbo. Saul saw the army of the Philistines and was afraid. And um, they defeated Saul and his army. David and his men mourned the death of Saul and his sons for the de defeat of Israel. Thank you. So very good. Uh, Joel Shiba gave an entire explanation about the first topic, Light of Justice. We studied uh, David and Ziklag and where, uh, what are the places David went. So she explained all the places uh, where David went. So it was a uh, well done performance. And let's once more clap our hands and appreciate the first competitor, Sister Joshiba. And second, uh, I hope Sister Alcina has given the name for memory verse. Okay. Now we have Brother Ajay. Can you come, friend? Ajay. Let's all clap hands and welcome him. Benefits of good works. Good works are the glory of God. It, it reveals the will of God, the reward of inheritance, the unfacting ground of glory, uncorruptible ground. Amen. So, Ajay told about the benefits of good works. So he told, the good works have the glory of God. It revealed the will of God and the reward of inheritance, the unfading crown of glory and uncorruptible crown. So all these points were said by Ajay. Can you clap hands and encourage him? OK. Next we have Sam. Sam, are you prepared? Yes. And the next participant is Ashmita. Okay. Theme, Light of Justice. In Luke 11, 42, Pharisee neglects justice and love of God. Psalms 82, 3, give justice to weak and fatherless. Christ followers are called to do justice. In Psalms 89, 14, righteousness and justice are the foundation of our throne. I didn't listen what Sam told. Anyhow, let's all encourage him by clapping their hands. OK. And then Ashmita. Let's all clap hands for the next participant, Ashmita. Praise the Lord. I'm going to tell about the theme, Light of Good Works. Tabitha, a woman, well-known woman, in he, she was living in jo Jopa. Uh, Tabitha, her name in Greek is Dorcas. Dorcas' his spiritual name is Deer. As in Psalms 42, 5, Deer pranks for water as my souls long for God. Like this, Dorcas also long for doing good works. And Psalms in 19, in 29 and 9, it says that we have to produce more souls for Christ. We have to produce more souls by sharing our gospel to others. In Bible, one other man that who did good works is Cornelius. He's a good man. His good works reached the heaven. Then Jesus sent his angel and blessed him and his family with, good, with Holy Spirit. And one another man, the rich man and the Lazarus. But he didn't help the poor Lazarus. He, the Lazarus was longing for the food, but he didn't help the man. Finally, he was thrown out to the hell. It is all about the good works. Good works is giving to the poor and the helpless. But divine works are showing their worth to the one who matters. Like Dorcas, we have to help the poor and needs. Good works gives many benefits and some are. 
good works have the glory of God as it is in John 14:26 and it reveals the will of God it is in Re- Revelation chapter 22 verse 18 and 19 Deuteronomy 12 and 32 The reward of inheritance it is in Colossians chapter 3 and verse 23 to 24 it gives the unfading crown of glory it is in chapter p first peter chapter 5 1 to 4 it gives the uncorruptible crown it is in first corinthians chapter 9 verse 24 to 29 good works are also linked to the justification sanctification and glorification the first work good work is to share the gospel to each and others we are created for doing good works the presence of holy ghost gives the power of doing good work for each and every one of us thank you ashmita so very good fluency in english and uh, she was she done a very good job and uh, we appreciate ashmita for this so let's all clap hands and appreciate her okay so i'm very much happy to see the kids how uh, one day teacher okay this is a valuable opportunity so this week now you are teaching and we are listening so as a teacher what are the things we will undergo you should also know for that only you are making to teach okay so while you are teaching you would have seen many are not listening properly many are not sitting in a proper posture and doing lot of mischiefs so each and every day when teachers they are going through everything okay so as you get an opportunity as a teacher and recite what you have studied you would have seen uh, the difficulties the teachers face so when you come to god's presence you should be a good listener okay so once again let's all clap hands and encourage uh, ashmita for the wonderful performance okay next is uh, rufus brother rufus followed by sister alsina praise the lord love love your neighbor as yourself means love everyone helping the person who needs help is helping christ the only thing that matter is what you do don't don't let labels fool you don't search for reward thank you so he was uh, telling about the benefits of good works so that is, uh, that was a wonderful so we appreciate for your effort and next time you prepare more so girls are uh, taking lot of time and boys within seconds you are finishing so i hope next time when you that is next week is also we are giving you an opportunity so while you prepare for the next week so prepare like a sermon okay how the teachers will take read the bible passage like that you should know how to take the sermon okay if you don't know you can ask me so that i will help you okay now we have uh, all seen all let's all clap hands and welcome her praise the lord today i am here to tell about the light of reconciliation through a parable of prodigal son The story of prodigal son shows us the picture of God's unconditional love towards us as his children. He loved us while we are still sinners. We are demanding though we are demanding and not being faithful, God is still our faithful and loving father. Now I'll tell the theme verse of this parable. I will set out and go back to my father and say to him, Father, I have sinned against heaven and against you. Luke seven, uh, Luke 11:18. Now we request Kevin to tell the memory verse of the parable. Praise the Lord. Memory verse. Lord is gracious, rich in love, slow in anger, slow in anger, slow in anger. Psalms 145 point eight. Thank you.
so that was wonderful alcina um, and also uh, um, alcina's brother recited the memory verse so jaba please uh, include uh, the name of kavin in the memory verse competition okay so now we have uh, our own followed by king joel let's all clap hands for our own yes and after king joel johan and then john and any other followed by jona gracia any other participants left are you prepared princey yes so no yes the prepared okay so uh, after this we have the uh, display of our titles with the story okay so the kids those who are uh, uh, as in the 25th episode we displayed the 25 titles lesson with the story what you have studied likewise today for the nine topics the kids those who are given names for that uh, please go to the volunteer sister divya and uh, sister madhi christi and be prepared because only four more participants are left now we have brother arun let's all clap hands and welcome him praise the lord i am tell about the light of good works good works giving the poor and the helpless the but to give us works to show them where or then the one who made god works have the glory of god i related to the god of god i reward the infinite house i undertaking the crown of glory untroubled to the crown thank you. Hi guys today i am going to talk about light of restoration the places where david went he stood before saul he conquered philistines cave of adulam wilderness of zeeb wilderness of mount thank you so king joel was explaining about the places where david went on the theme uh, light of justice followed by johin let's all clap hands and welcome johin benefit of good works uh, good works make good works have the good works have the glory of god it revealed the will of god the reward of inheritance the unfracting crown of glory uncorrectable crown thank you so thank you johin and let's all clap hands for him wonderful job within a short time he prepared well uh, okay john okay let's all clap hands for john followed by jona gracia so please tell the theme and then you can start explaining theme light of empowerment of holy spirit memory verse for everyone practicing evil hates the light and does not come to the light least is deeds to be ex- should be exposed john 320 very good john told the memory verse okay now uh, we have jona gracia let's all clap hands and welcome her why are so sad my smiling let's all clap our hands and welcome jona team light of peace memory verse peace i live with you my peace i give to you not as the world gives do i give to you let not your hearts be troubled neither let them be afraid memory verse you keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because he trust in you we want to trust our jesus so he will help in uh, when we are in trouble So thank you Jona 
she told both the theme verse as well as the memory verse for the particular theme what she recited. Okay, so uh, all our eloquation competition gets over. Okay, I hope you all happy. Christy, oh, Christy is there, sorry. Christy Celsia, let's all clap hands for Christy because your name was not here, sorry. Praise the Lord, everyone. I'm going to talk about light of spring of everlasting water. True worship is explained in John 4.14. In John 4.24, it is re we can read that God is spirit, and those who worship him must worship in spirit and truth. Jesus is explaining about the true worship to a Samaritan woman. This, uh, Samaritan woman. Samaritan, Samaritan woman is a uh, character in the Gospel of John. So, Samaria is one of the regions close to Galilee. The Samaritans do not like to speak with Jews. Samaritans do not worship God in the temple of Jerusalem. Je uh, as a Jew, Je Jesus went to the Samaritan woman and asked him a drink of water. She was surprised and she told, "You are a Jew. How can I give you? A, uh, how can I give? How can you ask me a drink of water?" Then he explained about the living water. He said, "Who drinks this water will be thirsty again. But what I will, what I will give them, if they drink, they won't be thirsty." And about living water, living water means God's blessing and spiritual power flows from God. It is a God source of living water. Living water gives us eternal life and satisfies us our thirst. The living water Jesus gives us flows from us and bless others. We should not forsake the fountain of living water as it can lead to the eternal life. Thank you. So, okay. so that was wonderful. Um, so all the participants and uh, we appreciate for the your work towards this eloquation competition. As I told you earlier, it is the competition, okay? So how you recited, how many time you have taken, so did you uh, tell the theme properly? And according to how you presented, the marks will be provided. According to that, uh, we'll give you the prizes, okay? So since uh, uh, we are uh, divided into two weeks, okay, so this week, we are giving the prizes for the memory verse, and for the next week, we are giving the prizes for the eloquition competition, okay? Because next week also, we are giving you another opportunity. Because uh, since uh, many of the kids, adult children, they didn't have proper time, so yesterday only I have uh, forwarded the notes to the boys, and girls received one year, one I mean one week uh, before, so they prepared well. But boys, yesterday night only I forwarded the notes to them. Okay, so uh, they can't able to prepare properly. So I hope one week is there, so they will prepare well the next week. So after the next week of your participation, we'll decide the winners according to how you presenting. Okay, now. Uh, moving on to the next session, the display of the titles, what we have studied. We have the kids according to the order, what story they studied and what theme they studied. For light of good works and light of justice. Um, so totally nine topics. First, in light of restoration, what parable or what Bible passage uh, did the teachers taught you that you have to tell in the mic okay do you understand yes or no yes okay so before that um, okay after this uh, display of the titles and the story I invite uh, sister Divya to come front and explain about the nine um, that is uh, the craft uh, time today sister Rosalind she didn't come so she will take time and explain about the nine titles and you have to match okay the titles will be there in one uh, area and next uh, B section will be the st um, the stories what you have studied so you have to match according to for example light of good works means you have to ma mark the story of Dorcas like that 
So who uh, is finishing in the correct time will receive the prize. Now we have the kids. Let's all clap hands and welcome them. So who is coming first? Who is coming first? Light of restoration and what story we studied. We are going to recollect everything. Okay. So for the past nine weeks, we studied nine titles. So each title followed with a story. Some might be parables, some uh, biblical passages and biblical stories. So according to that, now first, King Jassil, come. Let's all clap hands for King Jassil. He will tell the theme and the story. Light of Restoration, King David. OK, let's all clap hands. The kids, can you remember the title? Light of Restoration, David and Ziglag. OK, we studied about David, the places where he all went. So you go and stand. OK. Next, we have Beni, uh, Benihin with the Light of Reconciliation. The kids, the volunteers, can you tell the kids to tell the story plus the lesson? Light of Reconciliation, Parable of the Prodigal Son. Very good. So, Light of Reconciliation, the Parable of the Prodigal Son. Go and stand there. Now, I'll ask the questions. The audience, you should tell the answer, OK? So, this is also like a competition. The kids telling the correct uh, story will get the prize. So these two didn't tell the story. They told only the theme. Only I helped them. So let us uh, see how other kids are telling. Please don't help them. Okay? Let them uh, see the picture, understand the story, and tell. Okay? Come. Blessing is very well, I hope, so. Light of justice. Good Samaritan. Very good. Light of Justice, the parable of Good Samaritan. Okay. All clap your hands. Next. Light of Good Works. Darkness. Okay. The story of Dorcas. Light of Good Works, the story of Dorcas. Till this time, only Blessing has told correctly. So let us. See how others are telling, OK? So you're not listening properly, I hope. Light of springs of everlasting water, Samaritan woman. Very good. John told correctly, light of springs of everlasting water. We studied the story of the Samaritan women. Next. Light of humanity. Place of tax collector. OK. Light of uh, humility, the Pharisee and the tax collector, the parable of the Pharisee. So boys are telling correctly. Let's all give one, one more clap for them. Let us appreciate their good works. OK. Sam. Light of Empowerment of Holy Spirit. This is the story of Nicodemus. Very good, Sam. Uh, Light of Empowerment of the Holy Spirit. The story of Nicodemus in John chapter 3. OK. Next, Rufus. So Rufus, you have to tell what you studied. OK, don't ask help. Satan, Jesus, temptation. Light of overcoming temptation. Okay, what did you study? Okay, so he told that the discussion between Satan and Jesus. Okay, very good. Rufus, uh, it is on the light of overcoming temptation. I told about the difference between testing and temptation. Very good. Now last, Ajay. Please come. Light of peace. 
Jesus teaches of disabled. Okay, very good. So this was last week's topic, and uh, Sheila's sister took a very wonderful lesson, Light of Peace. We studied about Jesus. What did he tell in John chapter 15 about uh, peace? We studied a lot of things. Okay. So let's all clap hands for this wonderful children. Let's all clap hands. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So today uh, it was very, we had a fun time with the kids and everything got over so soon. Now uh, it's only 4.20, but we'll, uh, we'll finish only at 5. Okay, don't worry. <laughs> now uh, we'll have Sister Divya to come front and she will give you one work okay so the participants all the all the kids those who are in the church are the participants of this game and uh, the nine topics with the nine stories or parables everything uh, written okay you have to match according to the proper order so she will tell once and she will tell what you have to do let's all clap our hands and welcome sister divya So praise Lord. So are you happy? So are you enjoying this session? So some are not happy. Okay. So I hope you are all uh, seeing this uh, question, right? Can you all see this? Yes. Who are not able to see see that? Okay, actually this is a match the following, following. okay. So uh, in the left side, uh, there will, uh, the, we had uh, written the stories, okay. And in the right side, we have written, uh, written the important places which are related to that story, okay. Are you following? Huh? So in the left side, we have written, what we have written? The left side, we have written all the stories which you have studied till now, okay? So on the right side, we have written the important places related to that story. You have to match that and you have to tell me the answer, okay? So are you ready? No? Are you ready? You are not able to see. So can you please zoom that uh, picture? See, okay, I will uh, tell the question and the choices of the answer. At least try to answer that questions, okay? So first, uh, what you have studied uh, first, uh, the first story. David, correct. And uh, just uh, uh, look at that uh, left side uh, 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 left side places. What's the important place that mentioned in that story? Malcolm. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. No. Ah, very good. See, luck. <laughs> so, okay, you clap hands for him. He uh, said that correct answer. Okay, what's the next question? It's Portugal son. Squander his health, wealth. Okay, correct answer. Next question is, Samarian. In, correct. The next question is, Dorcas. Jopa, 
Hey, please clap your hands for uh, Ashmita. She said the correct answer. The next question is Samarian women. Will you give me a drink? So boys, what happened? Uh, now all the girls were answering. You were very silent. Okay, next question is Pharisee. If you know the answer, stand up and say the answer. Pride. Pride. Sharon said the answer. Okay. The next question is tax collector. Tax collector and no wrong answer. Uh, ah, humility. Clap your hands. The next one is stone. Bread. The next one is angels. Okay, serve to him. Clap your hands. I think next one will be the very easy answer. I didn't uh, even ask the question, but you said the answer. Okay, Jesus said, peace be with you. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this session. Thank you. So, David, uh, please see here. So, those who told answers for this uh, session, can you please stand up? Those who and all told answers. Please stand up. Sister, please note down the name. Because the all-rounder uh, participation in all the thing will get a good prizes. OK. Very good. Um, we appreciate for your good listening skills. OK. You have listened the lesson, and you have learned the lesson properly. So I hope, uh, since this is the first week, um, uh, it was very good. Your all your participation was uh, very well presented. I hope in the next week you will do well. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can I hear a louder hallelujah? hallelujah. Okay. Now uh, we are going to see some images. Okay. From the uh, nine topics what you studied. Okay. So you see the image and tell the uh, proper lesson. I mean proper answer. So uh, now also this is a competition. So if you know the answer, you stand up and tell the answer. According to how you are uh, telling the answers, we will give the prizes. So please display the first picture. Yes. So this is also based on the nine topics. Let me recite the nine topics. Light of restoration, light of reconciliation, light of justice, light of good works, Light of springs of everlasting water, light of humility, empowerment of the Holy Spirit, overcoming temptation, and light of peace. Those who know the answer, stand up and tell. Sister. <laughs> so David only told, uh, and King Jasil also told. Okay. Next, next picture. Uh, Divya, please don't put in the order. Okay. Okay. What story? Huh? Light of light of justice. The parable of. You have to be specific in your answer. Okay. Uh, so for this, I can't give any prices. Okay. Next picture. What is this story related to? Uh, yes, Alcina, Alcina, tell. Uh, what story? Uh, the Pharisee and the tax collector. Divya, is it correct? Yes? Okay. So Alcina got one mark. Okay, next. 
Sharon, uh, you also uh, uh, you also will get marks for this. Okay, next. This is a very easy picture. Uh, okay, very good. Oops. Light of overcoming temptation. Okay. Uh, Rufus uh, gets one point. Wait, wait. Ah, okay, you are telling the theme correct. You have to tell what lesson you studied. Huh? Very good, very good. The parable of the Samaritan woman. Very good, very good. Next. What is this? Nicodemus. Okay, what lesson? Theme. Now you are telling the story but not telling the theme. Girls, you know the theme? The story of Nicodemus. On what topic did you study? Huh? Very good. Benihin. Benison. Okay. Light of empowerment of the Holy Spirit. That's all, Divya. One more. Okay, what is this? Rufus, correct. Uh, Rufus uh, told the correct answer. Light of peace. Okay. That's all. What is this? Uh, Johin. Johin told the correct answer. Light of good works, the story of Dorcas. Okay. Now, I hope uh, uh, Sister wrote the, uh, the, those who told correctly, your names have been noted. Okay. Now, uh, since all the participants of the memory verse competition one more left. One more. What is this? Yes, girls, girls. Very good. Yes. Ah. So you told only the story and uh, Benny Hinch told the uh, theme, Light of Reconciliation, the Parable of the Prodigal Son. Okay, very good. So, now the participants of the memory verse. Can you come front? King Jasil and Sharon, Benihin, Kiruba, Daniel, David, Blessen, Ruzen, uh, Ruzenka, Queen, Ruben, Raja, Jaden, Sam, John, Jonah, Okay. Any other left? Anyone recited memory verse? Ah, Kavin. Okay. So, uh, I invite Akka, Lata Akka to come front and uh, give the prizes. So, when they receive the prizes, all the audience clap the hands and encourage the kids. All are the winners. All got first prize. Okay. Because uh, the judge, uh, Jabba Akka, given the 10 marks for all the participants. Because all recited well. Okay, all did a good job. Okay, well then, now each one are receiving the prize. Now uh, King Jassel is receiving the prize. Let's all clap hands. Well done, well done. Okay. Then... Jaden, let's all clap hands. Okay. Then, John. Let's all clap hands for John. Very good. God bless you. Next is John. Let's all clap hands for uh, Sam. Sam. Next, Rosen. Uh, Rusen, I, am, I can't get her name. Queen. Let's all clap hands for Queen. Okay. And then, Ruben Raja. Well done. You have recited well. Okay. Sharon receiving the prize for reciting the memory verse. 
all got 10, 10 out of 10. Okay, everyone decided well. Good. David. All clap hands for David. Can you please face the ca camera? Kids, can you please face the camera while you're receiving the prizes? All clap hands for them. Clap hands. Next. Very good, very good. Okay. Next is Benihin. Johin. Lesson and Kabin. Let's all clap hands for this wonderful kids. Thank you, Akka. Thanks. And now for the participation on uh, the competition, which was uh, led by Sister Divya and the pictures. Okay. So uh, on comparing the quiz as well as the PPT, few of the students uh, they participated in both and they got prizes. So the first one is Sharon. Please come, Sister. Uh, for this, I invite uh, Sister Sheila to come front and give the prizes. So, Sharon has participated both in quiz as well as in PPT and told the correct answer. Okay? So, let's all clap hands. Clap hands, all of you, while she is receiving the prize. The next is Alcina. Alcina. In quiz as well as in PPT. Okay. So let's all encourage the kids. The next is Benison. Benison in quiz as well as in PPT. So other kids, well done. Uh, next is David. David, both in quiz as well as in PPT. Where is David? Okay, okay, you come, Daniel. Come and get the prize. So all clap your hands. Very good. God bless you. Um, so then, Ashmita, Blessen, and uh, you all got prizes. Okay. So is there any prize left? Four. Okay, we can give to... King Jassil, please come. All clap hands. And Ashmita, Ashmita, come friend and get your prize. Rufus, Rufus told to answer. You got the prize, your brother got prizes. Okay, you can receive from him. Yes. Rufus. Okay. And Johin, Johin. Let's all clap hands for all the wonderful kids, those who receive the prizes. Okay, God bless you all. So, thank you kids, those who participated in all the competitions. And this is not yet over. It will continue for the next week also. Okay. So, um, I will repeat the... Uh, what are the competitions we'll have for next week? So please listen. Daniel, listen here. Okay. So next week you'll have a fancy dress competition. Okay. Fancy dress competition next week. So you have to, uh, I'll tell you the how you have to prepare and come. So those who are willing to participate can give your names. Okay. Okay. Now itself, they both are so eager to participate in that. And again, uh, we finish all the memory verse this week. So next week, you have to study the theme verse. Okay. So next week, all the nine topics, theme uh, verse, you have to study and come. And you will receive the prizes for 
that okay and then the eloquation competition still not yet uh, we decided so since the boys as i told they received the notes uh, only yesterday so they was not able to prepare well so one week we are giving time for both boys and girls to prepare well and today while you uh, go to your home you get the um, the notes okay the notes are with me as well as with uh, sister divya if you want you can get with her and you can prepare and if you uh, if if the notes are not available we'll forward in the whatsapp okay so you prepare well and i hope ashmita and uh, many of them uh, told about the story also the first participant joshiba told every whatever she studied in the lesson the first lesson light of justice she told about the story theme verse and what are the points uh, we told everything she told so nearly for 15 minutes i hope she uh, uh, gave us a good presentation so the marks are uh, been allotted according to how you present so since this is a first uh, so next week i hope a better thing from you i hope your exams are going on but we have to give the first importance to a uh, lord jesus so that uh, jesus will give you wisdom now in this week who and all going to write your exam please stand up in this week uh, who and all is going to write your exams okay those who are studying in plus 2 that is public examination 10th 11th okay revision exam uh for all the students okay so now i call uh, lata akka to pray for the students see please remain silence please remain silence don't speak in between don't speak in in between okay children you have to join you have to pray okay you have to pray for this akka and for this all anna those who are standing the lord should give them good wisdom so that they will uh, perform well in their examination now we are going to pray for them for that i invite akka lata akka to come forward and pray for those students those who are writing the examination let's all join together and pray father we praise you jesus lord we come into your thy presence lord let us hand over this little children into your hands oh god father especially they are preparing for the annual exam and the government exam lord lord the children those are standing in your feet lord bless these little children even though the exam is going to happen lord they have given first importance to you lord they come into your thy presence lord bless these little children with the abundant knowledge and the memory power lord lord what they have studied lord you kept everything in their memory power lord now seek you first the kingdom of god let everything will be added into your life according to this prophetic words lord bless this little children with your divine knowledge master lord fill this examination hall lord you have to hold the pens and you have to write the exam before they enter into the exam no exam hall lord lord you fill your presence with every one of this little children master lord you have to show the difference between your children and others lord while they coming out with the examination hall lord they should glorify your name lord that you bless each and every one of these children master with our diamond knowledge master surely lord we receive the blessings to this children master lord and may god bless these little children lord they are preparing for the exam lord you help them what they have to study lord keep it everything in your memory for master lord you all the things and you have to write the exam lord write the things was was all these things in the lord and the savior jesus christ name amen let's wish you all the best uh your prayers when you enter into the examination hall uh, before getting the question paper 
you must go ahead and try and then stop riding god will surely help you you are come out successfully thank you so thank you lataka for the wonderful prayer and for the good advice for those uh, kids those who are came here so i appreciate brother uh, aron and uh, sister esther uh, because tomorrow is 12th public but also you participated in today's english sunday school so please both of you stand up so all clap hands for aron and esther okay god bless you tomorrow you are going to get good marks because you didn't skip the english sunday school you give importance to god because many of the children they are always studying studying they telling the, uh, i'm i'm don't having any time to come to church to participate in the church activities um, but today i i know how uh, how much of uh, tension you all be because tomorrow you are going to appear for the public exam apart from that today you have came and uh, so i'm so happy for our own and esther okay so now i'm going to conclude the english sunday school so kids god's presence amen so everything today it was a wonderful day lord jesus christ help you to recite the memory verse well and because of his guidance god has given us this wonderful opportunity many of the kids in our church also not having this valuable opportunity but jesus has given you this wonderful opportunity so as we are standing in god's presence please don't waste your time seeing here and there close your eyes close your eyes children don't talk with your neighbor close your eyes join your hands bow down your head and let us thank god hallelujah the beautiful name of jesus amen hallelujah i'm going to tell the names of god and the spiritual meaning you're going to tell praises you're going to raise your hands and tell praises first is the elohim the supreme god the god's incredible power and might the lord yahweh the god of authority abba he is the father god el elion the lord of most high el roi the god who sees el shaddai god almighty jehovah jaira the lord who provides jehovah nisi the lord is my banner jehovah rafa he is a healer jehovah shalom the lord is our peace he is a wonderful counselor the mighty god everlasting father the prince of peace he is the alpha and the omega the beginning and the end in our lives he is our righteous god he is our creator he is the lord of lords redeemer he is our shepherd He is the Emmanuel. He is the Messiah. Let's all raise our hands to the mighty heavens and praise God. Now I want to hear your voices. Those children, those you are going to write exam, you ask a lot for the wisdom. Hallelujah! You have prepared a lot for one year. You have prepared. You have studied, but within two hours, you have to be prepared in your exam. everything should come into your mind so that you will write better so ask the guidance ask the help of the holy spirit and other children all many of you are going school going children ask for the wisdom from the lord jesus because he is a provider he provides those who are, if you open your mouth and ask god he will give everything to you hallelujah hallelujah let's all praise god open your mouth and praise god let your ha- heart be filled with uh, filled with the thanksgiving we have to enter the gates with thanksgiving hallelujah hallelujah we praise your wonderful name of father hallelujah as we draw near to your presence lord amen give us your spirit guidance into our lives you take control in our lives so oh father thanks for all the kids those who have come here today to bless your name to praise your name you 
deserve all our praises and glory. Hallelujah. Oh, wonderful Savior. You are a lamb of life. You are the rock of salvation. We praise your wonderful name. Hallelujah. There is a name I love to hear. I love to sing its worth. It sounds like music in my ear. The sweetest name on earth. The name of Jesus. As a how I recited the name which is given in the Bible. Yahweh. El Roy, El Shaddai, Jehovah Jireh, Nisi, Jehovah Rapha, and Jehovah Shalom. It is a beautiful name, the sweetest name on earth. You are going to call the name of Jesus while you are opening your mouth and call. Lord, when you confess that I love Jesus, surely God is going to give you blessings and wisdom. Hallelujah. We are going to sing this song and praise God. Hallelujah. There is a name I love to hear, I love to sing its word. It sounds like music in my ear, the sweetest name on earth. Oh, how I love Jesus. and say within us. We submit our body into your hands as a sacrifice. Spirit, take control in our lives. In the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus, we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and do not forget his benefits. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 